Hi there. So in this video, I'm going to show you how to use radio button control in VB.net. So go to view menu, click on toolbox and you will find radio button toolbox control. So let's check this one. Drop it on your UI. Then add one more. Okay, so you have two radio buttons right here. Okay. We can set the default value for each one as false simply by going to radio button one dot checked equals to false. Same for radio button two. Let's make their default value set to false. Okay. Once you have that set, you can simply go to edit the properties for radio button and find the text. You can say one option as yes and second option set to no. Okay, now you have these two options. If you use conditional logic and perform some operation like selecting yes or no will bring up some message box or pop-up box for the user okay so you can add that logic depending on how you want program to operate so let's for the basic let's run this program and check out how it works so by default it is selected to one of the options so far it is yes so we have to disable that so this was our short video on how to use radio button control in vb.net windows form application